Hi everybody, I'm Solomon, the Arkansas Diamond Miner. Uh, today we're going to go inside and look at the changes that they've made on the search field. Uh, the south end, they've actually moved a lot of dirt around and, and pulled it back up into the east drain. Um, if you've seen the tour of the search field that I did a couple videos back, which I'll put a link at the end of the video, um, you can kind of have a before and after picture of what they've done. So uh, we'll go inside and kind of look around at that. All right, so we're out here in the search field, and they've got this dozer parked out here. So what they're doing, you can see these rippers on the back. They are going through and ripping this um, about three foot. That's pretty close to a three foot ripper on the back of this dozer. So um, I'm going to turn around and look behind me here. I'm on the north end, and you can see it kind of looks like it's been plowed, but it's not actually plowed. It's been ripped with those rippers. So they've done all but just a little bit right here in the north side. And you can see it's pretty rough. And we'll go look at some of the other areas. There's actually pretty good size uh, holes from where they've hung on some big boulders. Okay, I'm standing on top of Beatty's Hill. And you can see that they have pretty much ripped up the entire search area with that dozer. That's the Discovery Center back there behind the old boat arc tree. And looking back off toward the south, you can see the wash pavilion there is pretty full. I'll step over here. The south wash pavilion. Down there in the distance looks pretty full too. There are a lot of people out today. It's a really nice day. The high temperature is supposed to be in the 60s. So it is a perfect day to be out here. You can see how rough some of that search field is right there. There's some places where some big boulders have been chewed up here. You can see this family right here is digging around some of the bigger boulders that got pulled up. Okay, so I'm at the north end of the west drain. You can see that this has all been ripped with the dozer going all the way down and They've actually went a little bit further back in there. You can kind of see right there, they've gone actually down into the drain itself and done some ripping down there. So they've just about done the whole area back in there. That's kind of the back side of Canary Hill right there. You can see that corner of that shade pavilion, that's off the west side of Canary Hill. Okay, so there's the boot wash station. So this is right on the left as you enter the search field from the Diamond Discovery Center and the path that goes over to the wash pavilion. It's right up there. And you can see there's a lot of people out here, but what they've done is they've taken material from the south end of the search field and moved it up into the east drain. And they have actually filled in quite a bit because uh, there was a pretty sharp drop off from the side of the trail. And now they've filled that in with all of the material. So we'll go down there to the south end and take a look around. Okay, so there's the south wash pavilion. We'll look up here, that's the north wash pavilion. So I'm standing down here looking over Canary Hill. You see the sign right there for Canary Hill. And you can see, this is pretty tore up. There is a lot of uh, boulders that have been turned up. Um, for some of you that have done some studying, Canary Hill is a good place to find amethyst. And now that some of these boulders are broke up, there's probably a lot of people that are out looking for it. And that is looking south. There's the old pig pen areas down there. And that area down there is where they've actually done some of the uh, dirt moving. They've scooped out several feet of dirt and moved it up to the top of the east drain. So we'll kind of walk around over here and look at the west drain while we're over here. Okay, I'm on the south end of the east drain. You can see that's the uh, creek bed leaving the search area. 
and as I pan around here you'll be able to see they have moved a lot of dirt. They've done a lot of dozing back in here and they ripped it all up. They've gone up the sides a little bit. This was all grass. Kind of looked like that right there. So they have done some pretty major moving back in here. Um, and this is going to have a lot of water flowing through it. Um, this is going to be a very good area once we get some erosion through here. There's going to be a lot of uh, silt taken away and a lot of gravel is going to be left behind. And it's it looks like this for quite a ways upstream. Okay, I'm here on Canary Hill. You can kind of see my hat there is a size comparison for some of the boulders that are turned up and it's there's a lot of boulders that size up here. It has been ripped up and it is pretty rough. So hopefully once they get the plow out, we'll get some good rain. They can plow this up real good. Uh, that's looking back off to the north. You can see our South Wash Pavilion there. But once we get some good rains, this is going to do a lot for erosion right here. We should be real good shape to have good surface gravel. Alright, so there's Canary Hill. See the two wash pavilions there. So we're in the pig pen area. And looking back that way, toward the east, you can see kind of what they've excavated back in there. So they've actually taken out quite a bit of dirt. They've deepened it up a little bit. Alright, here's a little bit different angle. Look at the excavation they've done. This is on the very south end of the east drain. You can see the uh, Huddleston shovel marker right there. And directly behind it, they've taken quite a bit of dirt out all the way over to the east drain. Over, You can barely see it back in there. Right over there. So looking back up to the north, we're just down from the South Wash Pavilion. Hope you've enjoyed my video. If you would, please like and subscribe. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you.